Hello everyone, and welcome back to Dead by Daylight, where we are back in the Red Forest. It just seems to be our map today. So, we found a generator already. But will we get found? So this is our last toolbox that we have. If we're going to get any more before we prestige, it'll be because we found it in a chest. <coughs> it doesn't have any add-ons because we're all out of toolbox add-ons. But we're here anyway. We're making advancements. We are trying to get points so that we can move on to a second prestige, Fangman. Alright. It's been a couple hours since I recorded the last episodes, so we'll see if uh, our luck can turn around. Because we had good luck at the beginning of today. Then we had kind of bad luck with the last several matches that I played. So now I'd like to have good luck again. Oh, and also, I looked up what luck does. So, um, I was correct, it can let uh, you get better things from chests. It also gives you a higher chance of getting off a hook by yourself. Um, stuff like that. Goodbye tool chest? Yeah. So the tool chest is gone. I don't know why some of them make that horrible sound. Like, uh, is, is that a glitch or is it supposed to do that? I really, I want to know. Oh god. Let's just stay very, very still. Okay. <coughs> so unfortunately we lost all our progress on cleansing this, but there was no audible signal for where I was. Okay, he's pretty close. He isn't super close. That looked like the hillbilly. So I think we're fairly safe over here. Because we're by generators that are done. Where? Over there. So I mean... I would say it's a low overall chance of him coming for us okay dang it okay I don't think he's still nearby hello friend okay that is the hillbilly oh Jesus I'm running away. We've escaped, apparently. I am very, uh, skeptical. So it was the hillbilly. I was just surprised because we had not yet heard the, uh, we hadn't heard the chainsaw yet. And so that's pretty unusual. But perhaps he is not a huge fan of using the chainsaw. Which is, if, if that's true, I'm not saying it is, but if it is, that's a really good thing for us. Okay, I hear a generator that's being worked on. I can help you finish this up. Okay. Got a couple points for that. Is he going to come back over here? Because I kind of want to cleanse this totem. I haven't really noticed anything about him yet. Like, if he... He didn't get too far away from the the guy that I unhooked, so I think he kind of likes to stick around there. Okay, that tells me it might be a glitch, because I don't think it's supposed to make that sound. We only need one more generator done. I don't think there's anything up there. Alright. Oh god, we got closer. There he is. So he was headed this way, which of course suggests I should not head this way. 
But hey. Ooh. Where is he? He's chasing someone. I hear somebody. Alright, we got two of us. Maybe we can do this. Okay, so he's not super far away, which I am not a fan of. But hopefully, you know, he'll take a second to deal with that. And two people, I mean, I'd prefer if we had the third person, but hey. You do what you can. Right? Okay, he took them far away. And by that I just mean the other side of the house. It's not that far. He could be here in ten seconds. Oh, this person. Okay, bye. He heard the heartbeat and he was going to go, but I think the killer, the killer's staying over there, yeah. They're, wa they're waving their arms about. The killer's staying near them. So here's our last generator. Where's the other one? Over there. So. I learned my lesson with that nightmare fight. If you can escape, you should do it. Okay. They're still waving their arms about. He's still over there. Oh, but I, I don't... I know we don't have that many points right now. I know we don't, but escaping is 5,000. Well, I, I literally just said, like, I'm, I'm not risking it again. That is just too fresh in my mind right now to risk it for the biscuit. So we're leaving. <laughs> yeah, we got a pit. We're good. Did they all escape? No. Oh, he disconnected. Or, or something like this. It says they're still in the game, but this guy has no. So, like, the, the kill is saying there was an issue with that match, and it, it was a little laggy. So, I mean, maybe, maybe there legit was a, an issue. Alright. Let's join a lobby, actually, before we do this. Uh, but, hey, we legit escaped. I don't know how the points worked for anybody else, but I left. It almost feels like the killer just gave up. I don't think there's an option to do that, because if there is, I've never seen it when I've played the killer. So. I don't think you can. Like, I've only ever seen killers disconnect, but he got no points like he disconnected, but he was still in the, in the room. So we mostly have flashlights. We also have some lunch boxes um very rare add-on I mean like this is cool like instantly heal a health state that could be good increases luck of all survivors so I mean if somebody's down on the ground we can heal them in in an instant and I think that'll be useful I mean it could be useful won't necessarily if I never am you know given the right opportunity then it won't be useful why did the people leave okay bye I'm still here we're also saving up for this this seems like a very very good perk we have seven more days to get it so I think we'll be able to and I think we'll probably end up giving up our, our, our chest finding perk. We could also give up hope. Because this one, it only gives us anything good if we get to the point where, uh, where all the generators are done. And so if in a match we don't get there because we're losing, we never see any of the bonus from it. Now, of course, I think that it has helped me get out of some scrapes. Like, there have been times where I'm just like, 
I'm pretty sure the only reason he lost to me is because I was a tiny bit faster than he was expecting. And I, I think 7% almost makes you match the speed of the nurse and the huntress, who I think are, are two of the slowest killers. Um, I think you can outrun the shape at level 1 at that point, but normally uh, someone playing the shape wouldn't be at their terror tier 1 or evil within tier 1 by the end of the match, unless they really don't get it. I think I've had it happen once, and that guy looked like he was deliberately trying to win the match at tier 1. It didn't really go that well for him. Okay, I saw a generator way over there, but I figured there had to be one closer, and look, I was right. So I heard a hum. So you know what that means. If you hear a hum, you have a huntress. And I am not about that. I hate the huntress. Where, 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 where? Oh. Great. Not very far away. I'm out. I do not play games with the huntress. she though okay somebody got them down and I am running at this point for the sake of running question mark mainly because she was really close by and she creeps me out Huntress is to me the creepiest of the the killers. Also, I just know if we have a survivor called number one Huntress NA. So we just got three skill checks in a row as I was trying to say that. Okay, she's over there. That's pretty far away. Um, oh, somebody's here. Yeah, because we're getting a perk. Um, we're not using it, but it's the Nia the hat perk that I recently unlocked 10% uh, less item depletion and it holds true for people within a small radius of you so while it wasn't Nia, she had the teachable perk of Nia so I see a chest over there. I'd love to go search it, but right now we have a very, very useful item. And I'm really curious if the Huntress is just, you know, sticking around that person in the basement. Why isn't anyone getting her down? Yeah, she is. She is sticking around. The person's wiggling. And as far as I know, that just means that they're camping. To instantly be able to heal a health state would be very, very nice. Oh. I saw the Huntress, but then she turned around because somebody got that person down from the basement. So hey, at least she's not coming this way. And we can stay here. Oh no, the same person! That guy is unfortunate. We've had matches like that though, like for realsies. We've absolutely had them. So see, if that person managed to crawl away, it would have been an excellent way to use our med kit. Of course, we could also use it to help ourselves. Yeah, the Huntress is trying to bait people out to help them. I can see their sh her shadow going in front of her, of the person who's downed. So yep, somebody did heal them. She tells me she let them get away with it. We might have an interesting killer on our hands here. But we're going to play as if the killer is not friendly. Because they probably aren't. Never trust somebody that you know has your worst interests in mind.
because maybe they turn over a new leaf and they change their mind, but most likely they won't. Somebody else is hurt. Well, two generators are done. I think I was on both of them. Pretty sure. So, okay, there we go. Somebody else has done one. Yeah, because we have a lot of objective points. Which I'm all for. I love, I love getting points. That's why we're here. So, are you going to stay over there? Or are you going to come over here? We're not super duper far away. I don't know how far away you can hear the generator being worked on. Probably not from where that person's hooked. I don't think they make sound for that far. And then again, the, the sound of someone actively working on it is more quiet than the generator itself. So. Well, I'd love to go over there and help you out, I just don't think I'd make it. I'd have to run at this point. And I'm betting that you're being camped. So, sorry. Oh, I hear somebody. Oh, hey. I can heal you. Now, this may not be, like, where the exits. Okay, there's one that way, which is definitely the way to go. I'm like, me healing you right here, I probably should have just used the instant heal. Oh, there was the exit we were looking for. I did not find it. So we were not very much faster than her. And somebody disconnected, which is wonderful and lovely. So let's see how bad of a camper she is. Cause yeah, it's just that one other person left, and I think yeah, they're at they're at, they're at the other gate. Do I attempt to escape? I think the answer is yes. That didn't work. That was my best chance. And we it slightly increased our luck. Yeah, we're, we're screwed. This is it. No one escapes. One person disconnected. Well, that sucks. And no, they weren't an instant kill either. They're struggling as well. I was like, maybe if they have a chance to get down, they could do it. Well, we'll get all our struggle points at least. She's coming back over by me. Wow, only 600. That's strange. Normally you get 800. 800 plus. Alright, well that didn't work. I, I thought we were doing pretty well there. We were not. <sighs> so many points did I even get? I didn't get that many. So I didn't gain a pit, but I didn't lose one. Pretty much. Should have used that. But I wanted to save it. I, with her chasing me, I think there still would have been a certain amount of time to use the items, so healing probably wouldn't have been an option, but maybe it would have been. Maybe we should have tried it. I don't know. If you guys have used that item before and you know, then you can tell me. Um, but that's going to do it for this episode. If you guys enjoyed it, be sure to hit that subscribe button. And as always, I'm the Purple Peggy Sis, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.